कसरी खाने जो भो ये भैन अभी स्टिक बड़ नहीं खाना ट्राई करें हजब खाना ट्राई करें जस्ट तो तर खाए खाए पे तो छुट्टी रमा लगे Firstly, I like the shape, the spiral shape. It's very unique, and the taste about it, the masalas, everything, and the combination is so good. This is the ultimate prize. This is it. Now, my dear, aloo chaatha. So, then the decorations and the colors. Ani, aloo. I was expecting to see potatoes in different shapes and colors. The fries, doughs, and seasonings are well done on the inside and the outside. It's spicy. There's no crunch, but you can definitely feel the crusty exterior. It's good. This is Coca-Cola Hunger Hut. Bhaktapur has a long history, a history that goes back hundreds of years deep into the medieval age. A history so rich, so vibrant and so formidable that its relics still remain with us even today, having stood the test of time, change of regimes and evolution of our civilization. Which is not the reason I'm here today. You know this rich culture and uh The beautiful history are not the only things that make the experience of transcending here. Bhaktapur also has this amazing food culture that you cannot find anywhere else in Nepal. It is full of a local taste, authenticity, and unparalleled creativity. You know what? Today I'm taking you to this new place that I've discovered, and um, it is an addition to the booming food scene of Bhaktapur. I am standing right in front of. The Nathapol Temple, which is a beauty in itself, and today I'm going to Alucha. This place is called Alucha, and try out their special offerings in the midst of gods and temples. Wait up! Come with me. Nali pani parra chai lo, and oh yes. So the uh, Narapol temple is right there. Yes, yeah, but uh, it is sad and ukalo, so you can just take that road. We're almost here, guys. So this place uh, is located right opposite to Pashupati Mandir in Darbar Square, and you cannot miss out on this big yellow board that writes Alucha. Hi. Hello. How are you? I'm very good, thank you. I'm fine. Tapego, everything like potatoes, matro. You have nothing else? Yeah, we have rolls as well. Oh, okay. But uh, potatoes, ma, we add mm -hmm. some toppings and stuff. So okay. It's not only potatoes. We have chicken. And we have oh. fish, non-fish as well. Okay. Guys, this looks really interesting. Mm -hmm. What is it called? Tornado fries. Okay. So I will have this one. And what else should I? This is very popular, so I think you should try this one. What is it called? Fries with butter buttered chicken. chicken. Oh, okay, yeah, <laughs> sure. And uh, we feel like spicy, and this just came out, so we just. Uh, Chuila fries yeah, sounds interesting. Fries. So yeah, that's. It. What do you serve this with? I mean, so, so this uh, this comes with the aloo cha sauce. Okay. So if you like some sauce mm -hmm. with butter chicken and or chuila mm -hmm. fries, we can mm -hmm. give. This also comes with sauce. Though. Tapani malai extra mayo gardenas now attached. And don't keep ketchup anywhere near oh, my food. No, no, no. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> it's a typical summer day, guys, and I'm hungry as usual. This is a very cozy place, and I feel really good sitting amidst uh, the beautiful temples of Bhaktapur and eating. And also, I love this mural on the wall, which says "Potato Hunter." Tornado fries are a recent phenomenon in Nepal. There is a place or two in the valley where they serve tornado fries, and alucha is a recent addition to that list. To prepare tornado fries, they start with one single potato. It is clean but not peeled. It is then fed into a machine that slices the potato into a perfect thin spiral, which is then squared and then deep fried. When it comes out, it is sprinkled with a special in-house seasoning that adds some flavor to it. Oh, 
I'm hungry. Can't wait. Plus, the potatoes look delicious. So, you it, right? thank you. <laughs> so, you love me, right? So, I've got some meal. Okay. And this is our special meal based uh, sauce. Oh, thank you so much. Special Arucha sauce. So, thank I think you. you should try those. Thank you so much. Thank you. Guys, this looks tempting, doesn't it? First, let me figure out how to eat this. This is fluffy and crispy at the same time. Mm. Can you hear the crisp in the mic? Oh, this is good. Good guys, outright amazing. Forget all the fries in the market. This is it. This is lit. Mm. We still can't figure out how to eat this though. Guys, forget all the packaged fries in the market. This is the ultimate fries. This is it. It is inexpensive, it is easy to eat, and it has a perfect crunch to it because it is fried in the right temperature. You can also ask for um, other sauce if you want, that is ketchup, which is bad. I hate ketchup. But I'd recommend this one. This is just perfect. It's sweet, it's creamy, and a, a, a little spicy at the end. Besides tornado fries, they have classic fries too, but better than that is what they're calling the special choila fries. Uh, to prepare the choila fries, they start by dicing potatoes into french fry cuts. Here they call it the classic fries, but when the classic fries are deep fried for a little longer, for that extra crunchiness and dark color, and mixed with choila seasonings like cumin powder, ginger, garlic and salt, and tossed with diced chicken sausages. It acquires that distinct and familiar taste of choila and to add further to that taste and experience, they add a fried egg, sunny side up to this choila fries and all that for no more than just 250 rupees, which is not too bad considering the portion they serve here. comes my other food. Thank you. Okay, so this looks like choilas. It's a little dark. I think this is the only place where you can find such fries. I can't wait to dig in. Oh, bam, this is awesome. Choila uh, dosa, but then these are potatoes. Vegetarians, you found the right place. Oh, I'm sorry, there's sausages in here. But you can exclude the sausages if you want, I don't know. The fries doused in seasonings are well done on the inside and the outside. It's spicy, there's no crunch, but you can definitely feel the crusty exterior. It's good. I love the fries here. Um, perfect execution, love the taste, and it's perfect for two. Great substitute for the normal fries that you eat. Mm. I wonder how they do it. It tastes like chola, and it uh, smells like chola. It's really good. Really spicy too. They have experimented a lot prior to opening this joint with a lot of brainstorming and a lot of tweaking the recipe. So the food is perfect, both in terms of taste and pricing. And the one that stands out among all the fries is here, infused with butter chicken. Thank you. Thank 
guys, I have never had butter chicken with fries before and this is how it looks like. It looks delicious. Fries, butter chicken, cream on top. Oh, smells delicious. I can't wait to eat this. The fries itself is full of carbs and then the butter chicken which is again very heavy but I really don't mind until the food is really good and trust me it is. So rich in taste and so familiar local flavour and oh yes you cannot ignore the special sauce. This is just so good I can't really hold it because it's very tasty. individual ingredients here like uh, the, the sour cream, the butter chicken, the fries but try putting everything all at once and the taste is just so amazing. I strongly recommend this one. Well this is so amazing. I bet after this butter chicken fries are going to be the it food after lunch. What is with all this flavor? The fries in itself are really good and the combo is just super duper amazing. I just love it. You can actually get the taste of individual ingredients here. You can taste the cream, the butter chicken, the fries. First, I was able to establish the first one was tornado fries and classic fries. I was able to get different ideas. So, I was able to get tornado fries, classic fries, and cheese bacon, and soft sea, and soy sauce. And the sauce was very nice. I was able to get a single aloo and I was able to get a spiral. I was able to get a little bit of a taste. Like it tastes really nice. Don't need to fry it either because a bakari mana fresh and that tastes like like fresh is hot. Don't need to fry it by like cheese bacon pani mixer sa ani a choila fry it. Also, I have don't need to fry it kaya kosa and we are and we are going to try cheese bacon aile. Ya mixer sa awa ami alu awa NPP or me alu kaya kaya rakho but ya ko awa alu sauce or kosto arke different and mixer lai kosa. This is so much different. Like, I mean, like, I have muscle, I have combo, or any sauce, or any combo. It's a one for all the time. So, I have all the fresh, no, no, also feelings. So, I feel like, yeah, yeah, Thai fresh, all the one fresh type. So, I feel like, yeah, so, I feel like, 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 so, I पहले और एक फ्राइज को और एक ऐसे खाई रहे को तो टोनर के फ्राइज से पहले खाको थे ना और एक दम डिफरेंट लायो एंड इट्स रियली नाइस ना मेरे दे आलू था तो सो देन द डेकोरेशंस एंड द कलर्स अन्य अब आलू आई वाज एक्सPECTING टू सी पोटेटोस इन डिफरेंट शेप्स एंड कलर्स आई हैव जस्ट ट्राइड दिस फ्राइज सो यू तो एकदम ही मीठो था लाइक क्रिस्पी था अंदर सॉस और था हमारे रेगुलर सॉस और उन सा लाइक सिमिलर टेस्ट होने सभी था को सॉस को आई लाइक द सॉस यार को डिफरेंट था अन्य फ्राइज पर नहीं एकदम क्रंची था मीठो था I saw it first uh, when I when my friend posted in Instagram, tornado fries vanera, and I was very eager to try it. And they carry me go that way. As I say, Sathya or Sangha say, I am here to ask. Tornado fries. Uh, first, ma, I like the shape, the spiral shape. It's very unique, and yeah, and the taste about it, the masalas, everything, uh, the combination is so good. And especially the sauce, I like the sauce. Tornado fries first. They had it too, and I was eager to taste that. It was quite different from other fries, you know. And it was something you tornado fries ma. Just even ingredients are used, but it was it was good. First time they did that, it was a new town. I mean, Ramrod utilized it. So, and it was quite economic. They can't say that. I was just saying. 
सीट्स बस्ने ठावे हे एकदम कस्टली एक्सपेन्सिव ठाव से देखिदे है अब कति मैं को कंसेप्ट के होता अब एकदम एक्सपेन्सिव टाइप के डेकोरेट कर फूड आइटम्स एकदम एक्सपेन्सिव होता भाई तेज़ यहाँ हेने बितिक एकदम इकोनोमिकली सब होने गई इकोनोमिकली साउंड भाई देखि ये ठाव हे इट्स माई सेकेंड टाइम इन And also, this place is the second time I've been here. As far as I know, this is a new restaurant. It's so crispy. I like that. Yeah, and the sauce on it, I like that too. Uh, the price I just checked it is uh, relatively cheap as well, and it tastes nice. Yeah, this is much fresh, and crispy, and tasty. Uh, I'm Aishma, and. Uh, I, with my two friends, we own this place. It's been almost a year that we started this place. Well, to be honest, say, I'm uh, literally you, a random thought, okay? I mean, it's a kura gorda gorda, I go thought, oh, and we started digging in into this fries because uh, particularly fries, ko lagi bana, that's a case, hoy nanta, tehi bara, and I, alu chap. Because it's a new concept, bara, we just don't give fries. We try to serve it differently, bana, na a lot of poutine or whatever, the sauces or who, and in a different form, pan din sum like tornado, and with different spices. We didn't think that we'll go this far. It's to it's to ramble response, bara. So not only the taste, they like the size, they like the portions, and they like the servings, everything. So. सब पे वंदा बॉडी सेल होने से टॉर्नेड ऑफ़ फ्राइज़ हो इट्स इट्स डिफरेंट एस यू कैन सी है ना कॉट ए डिफरेंस है अन्य टेस्ट पानी अलग अति डिफरेंस है विदाउट स्पाइसेस एंड सॉस डिफरेंट होने से अन्य और कुछ ही क्यों वंदा फ्राइज़ विथ डिफरेंट काइंड ऑफ़ पुटीन अन्य हम इसे अब यू रेयरली सीन Fries served with some gravy or some poutine, right? So that's why it has become a little bit famous. Nevari kind of paira, soila fries bani nikale ko. Ani we just tried. Amro chef bani nevari, okay? Ani he just we just tried alikati soila fries lai soila ko masala le gori try gori ko. And then people liked it. People loved it actually. So so this came into existence, manum na. A secret sauce, say the name le ne secret one. But she say it's a little bit secret, and it makes our sauce special. The banu pada say it's a mayo based sauce, and we add a little bit of other sauces and a little bit of spices, and uh, we basically chill the sauce so that it's the taste is aligati san mito. First of all, say I'd like to thank everyone for coming to Alucha and giving it a try. अब आउनु बाहर को नया गेस्ट सर लाइज़े वुड लाइक टू से दैट वी बॉट लाइक न्यू कॉन्सेप्ट न्यू विथ आलू न्यू वैराइटीज सो वी वी वुड वांट यू टू कम एंड गिव इट अ ट्राई आई थिंक इट बी वर्थ इट थैंक यू आलू बीइंग माय फेवरेट वेजिटेबल टू ईट गाइस आई एंजॉय द होल ईटिंग एक्सपीरियंस � Apart from just the food, you will enjoy the ambience too. So come over to Bhaktapur, take a nice stroll, come here and eat. I will see you next week with more five interesting food stories. Until then, keep smiling, stay happy, keep eating, and do not forget to like, share, and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Also, find us every Wednesday from 6:30 till 7 on Kanthapur HD. Bye bye.